Welcome back to Elden Ring. Hello, Patches. You. Scallywag, you. Just not a nice person. Nah. How dare. All right. What what can we do today? Yeah, there's... give me give me options. I'm curious. Oh, there's so many things we could do here. Like, we... uh, let's start from the bottom up. We can check out more of the southern continent. You know, we got this swamp here, this grove here, trees, stuff, more mm -hmm. more swamp. You know, all all that. Not a priority. Uh, we can go back to Kalid and uh, check out this uh, fort for a part of the Dectus Medallion, or we can try and go to this place to see how we fare in getting a uh, really good item. Okay. Uh, I think we've dealt Limgrave enough. Uh, we spent most of Season 1 in there. Uh, don't need to really worry about here for the moment. We can probably leave that be. Uh, we've already explored up here. There's another Belfry we can go to. We got another one of those imbued stone keys. We can check out more in Raya Lucaria. We can uh, delve, delve around in there some more. We can head up into the uh, d the uh, Coward's Way to get into the uh, the uh, Altus Plateau and see if we can get through there. We can try and get our way through the uh, Volcano Manor, see if we can make our way through there. So, where do you want to go? Let me ask you this. Yeah. The item over in Kaled. Yeah. How much will it help you? Might be the best sword in the game. Cool, let's go. All right. I like best sword in the game. Okay. So, it's about, I'll say, right here. We're going to have to get a little creative to get down there, but we'll start here and see how we do. I'm sure we can improvise. Yeah, we're smart people. <laughs> you laugh every time I say that. Why? Well, I laugh every time because I remember what we did last session, and that was me yelling, Cheese! <laughs> <laughs> they are extremely smart people just yelling, Cheese! <laughs> what I'm looking for is a very beginner-friendly, uh, katana. And, uh, everyone who plays this game knows what it is, and yes, uh, it's what I got me through a lot of the game, too. There's no shame in that. No, no. Is that the most powerful sword in the game? Oh, no. Oh, okay, okay. It's a different sword. We don't, we don't get it until, like, way late game. So would this be considered, like, second best, maybe? Something to help you through a majority of the game? Oh, yeah, you, you can lean on a lot of it. It's not gonna help you through everything. Well, right, right, there's pluses and minuses to every blade, I assume. But you would not believe how much mileage I got out of uh, this katana we're about to get and uh, Night Maiden's Mist. Matter of fact, I think we got a good chance of getting getting this sword because of Night Maiden's Mist. Hmm. That's how, that's, that's how good we got it. I like to avoid these traps. Is it really through there? Let's see. I heard something crashing behind me. Not I a heard fan. dog. Not a fan. Not a fan. Not I'm a fan. hearing dogs, mate. Right, I think I found it. You just took out their fire! The Gale Tunnel. Oh, they got some wind going on in here. The thing about this place is that we're kind of trapped oh, down here. Oh, hi, boys! Here. <laughs> we're a little trapped down here. No, it's all right. You're fine. Until we clear it. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. See? Look, you're fine. There's some smithing stones down here, which is good. There's a thing over there I'd like to try and jump to. Yeah, very low down. I hope you don't perish. You did not perish. Nope. Excellent. No perishing today, but we do get a somber smithing stone. Actually helpful. Worth it. Yeah, it's just a simple drop down here, and yeah, yeah, uh, we're yeah. trapped until we get out. Yeah, after we do this, we should go use our smithing stones. It's been a hot minute. We haven't... We, yeah, that's another thing we can do. We can go to the uh, the round table, because we haven't really talked to anybody there yet. Let's be social, Except, mate. Like, okay, we'll be, we'll be social after we see how we do with this katana. Because the cool thing, we don't have to kill the boss to escape. Oh. But because we're stuck in here and we haven't cleared it, we can't leave yet. So just find the way out. Let's find the way out, which we can do. But this isn't exactly the easiest dungeon in the game, if you catch my drift. It's also not a uh, zero escape game. Oof. We can seek a way out. Totally. <laughs> just I don't think Sudoku can save us. <laughs> Did he just try to throw fire at you? Oh, poor guy doesn't know what yeah, to do. Yeah, I think do. he's a little stuck. Poor guy doesn't know what to do. Jeez! <laughs> Alright. Later, losers! Good lord. Man, that's so good. So what do you think that smells like? Just essence of death or poison shards? I think it smells like diamonds. 
Oh, inhaling diamond dust? It's it is literal diamond dust. Oh. Maybe maybe some glass shards for good measure. God. Oh. Oh. So uh, I was rewatching a couple of uh, backyard scientist videos. Yeah. Uh, I, I love that guy. He's yeah. he's gonna kill himself one day. Oh, though. probably. Yeah. I'm, I'm I'm gonna get a distressing message on Twitter one day saying yeah. that we have some bad news about Kevin. It's a uh, Florida man syndrome. <laughs> but, I uh, mean, it's yeah, totally. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, probably one of his most interesting videos are the harmful plants video. That's one of my. That, I think that's what got me into him. Goes it. Gimpy, goes gimpy, the, right? Yeah. Go under the microscope and see that this plant has thousands upon thousands of tiny needles, and that's what causes the the like the pain. That's what causes the pain in your fingers or wherever you get the plant on you. It's just uncomfortable. Oh, it just melts. That thing has so much friggin' health. Uh, it just melts, though. I Look at that number go up. to see it. Oh, number go up. Oh, Look just... at it go up. Now do it again. Let's do it again. Have some more cheese, Gromit. <laughs> He's backing up a little bit, he knows. Oh, he doesn't know that- he, he doesn't know that good. No, he doesn't. Ah! I guess I'll just have to advance a little further then, and throw a little bit, a little bit more, uh, shake of cheese on that ass. God, look at that number go up. Oh, he's stuck. He suck. Oh he's, he's my god. Because he knows you he has no so to run! Oh, we got health back. That's not good. By the way, what the hell is that? It's an octopus. Very angry octopus. I'll take your word for it. Okay, there you go. There's damage. That's damage. He's gone forever, right? Yeah. Oh, uh, no. M maybe? I don't think so. I don't think octopus, uh, go away. He doesn't octopus. count as a huge enemy or whatever those special ones are? No, but he, I think he's too big to uh, keep on the field, if you know what I mean. Oh, okay, I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah. Too complicated, too many dangly bits, yeah, too many yeah, yeah. meshes on top of one another. I think it's, we just, just wipe them away until the next reload, I say. Yeah, probably the next time we uh, disappear out of here, we'll he'll be back. But uh, we have a few more unsuspecting victims down here. I say we do a little bit, uh, little bit of cleaning up here. Hey, what's that sound behind me? Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, don't want to linger too much because they yeah. can gang up pretty good. They're also tossing things at you. They which are. Is not the best. Oh, he's going in full force. Yeah, eat this. Idiot. He didn't get got by it? Nah, I, I, I threw it over his shoulder, basically. Still got him, though. Still got him. Yeah, still got him. But now nothing can come through the cloud. Until it dissipates. Somebody paid the 199 for something to come through the cloud. <laughs> no! Who's throwing? I think they're just... Mining. Or is that just a spark of him yeah, hitting rocks? Yeah, okay. th I think they're mining. All right. What are they mining, UDJ? Oh, oh that's it's, fire. It's this guy. That's oh, fire. All right. Hey, buddy. You can, you, can, you can stop that. You do want you, some blood? Do you bleed? Is, you, you do bleed. That's that probably one of the most intimidating things I've ever heard. Do you bleed? Do you bleed? <laughs> that's in such a nonchalant manner, too. <laughs> Excuse me, question. Do you bleed? Do you bleed? Saying it that nonchalant is the sign of a serial killer. What I really hate is the over animeified one. It's like, do you bleed? Do you I want to hear your screams. <laughs> I'm done. Yeah, it's done. Hey, buddy. Hey, pal. What do you got? No, 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 no. Don't need to call your buddies. It's fine. God, with the amount of stamina you have now, it's very cathartic. Just slash, 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 slash until the guy dies. I know, right? How about I this can guy? Do this too. They're like mostly made of rock, so they take a little bit more. I was about to say, yeah. Uh... They're slow, but they're very intimidating, and they hurt quite a bit. And they throw stuff too. Can you like backstab them again, or? I probably could, but got away from the stamina. Come back up here. No, no, none of that. Up that did dead again, right? It's all right. There, there we, go. there we go. All right. Got to stab him through the bag of rocks. That's where all the nerves are. <laughs> uh, rummaging around my bag of rocks. Oh, hit a nerve. All right. Just about through. We gotta go through this little gauntlet here now. Yeah. In the ceilings. Where evil truly lies. There's a 
few. Well, these two here, where are they? You know where they are? Aha! That's the place. I'm thinking of a different area, by the way. Oh, but we can just open through here. Hey! Uh, Hello, Potman. The esteemed warrior. Where did you spring from? Uh, I was just around. To be a dead end, I'm sure of it. What's going on here? Help your button around the corner. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Well, stranger things happen at sea, or so I'm told. But onward to the Kalid Wilds. Ah, that dead end had me rather stumped. <laughs> It's time I set off. He sounds so normal. <laughs> He's just a guy looking to better himself yeah. physically. He just wants to be a good fighter, man. Doesn't the thought just set your heart aflutter? I'm just wondering, like, how words, how words come out of Potman? Were you guys trying to fight him? Were you guys trying to fight him? <laughs> Can we watch a couple were, of those? Were you trying to I, fight I him, see guys? What Ooh, that's Ooh, good. that is very good. All right, don't tell me you guys are trying to fucking yep, fight him. They, tr they did try. Alexander is good jar. He's good jar, man. Maybe they wanted to get his items before his quest ended, but, you know, whatever. Is he one of those, like, let's just call him, for the sake of argument, a super boss? If you actually try to attack him and kill him? Uh, I don't know about that. He's quite pathetic. Oh, he is? Yes. Oh. Well, never mind, then. So this is the way out. We seek the way out! We from, found out the the from digital limb grave. <laughs> the digital root of nine. Yes. So yeah, you could have completely stumbled in here by sheer coincidence, by absolute accident. And then not be able to leave until you find the other side. Well, technically you found the other side because Yeah, because that that's what Alexander was grumbling about. He's like, Oh, I can't believe this dead end here. Oh, okay, this okay. door here out of nowhere. Just what, what what a strange Oh, from the other side? Fascinating. Oh, unfortunately I can't get through the door. Alright. Well, let's see how we're doing. This is the big boss that has the the skill that I want or the the, the item that I need. You got the mist ready? You betcha. It's the magma worm. Let's fight a dragon. Okay. Oh hell yeah. Oh dear. That's gonna hurt. Hi, buddy. You actually look really cool. Just stay in that machines. Oh, it smells so delicious, actually. Ow. Uh, right before the cutoff, you asshole. No, it's all right. It's all right. You still got. It. That's gonna hurt. You know, of all the attack patterns of FromSoft games, this one- Oh, never mind! <laughs> I was about to say, this one seems pretty normal! And then he came charging in front of you, and did it again. Holy uh, shit. Jeez, uh, jeez, oh man, get away! Fucking freak. <laughs> God, you freak! Get away! Yeah, stay there, stay there. There you go. Stay right there. Yep. Right there. Be good, magma worm. That's just, just stay right. Eating his health. I love to see yeah, it. Yeah, I love it. Have some more. He's gonna be running. No, oh, never mind. Not running. I'm almost afraid to have you, you know, test the bleed theory. Whoa, whoa. Oh, here's the fire theory. Whoa. Okay, okay, okay. Cool it, cool it, cool it, cool it. Oh. I don't think we need to be testing theories at this moment in time. Okay, that's running. No, it's not. What the hell? Maybe that's why I'm so bad at these games. I can't tell attack patterns. You keep trying to react to it. It's like, okay, to me this, but you need to react to what he's actually doing. And... That's game. Yeah, get out of here. That's game. Well, uh, I didn't think I would one-shot him. That's the power of Night Maiden's Mist, you see. That was a cool-looking boss. Now, and you got a dragon heart for and that? And Moon Veil. Do we need the Dragon Heart to help make Moonvale better? Uh, Dragon Hearts are for getting special spells at Dragon Churches. Oh, okay. That's all that's for, really. So what does Moonvale do? Oh, Moonvale is a sword, my guy. I like Swords of the Moon. Uh, I wonder if I can equip it. Probably not. Show me the money. Damn it! We cannot equip it because our intelligence is too low. <laughs> We're too stupid to wield Moonvale. <laughs> but only by two points. 
Oh, hell yeah! Even by two points. Oh, hell yeah! We got 15,000. I, I know it's not enough to level up, but... Now I could take some time, uh... After this episode, and get a couple of levels up, and then we can get the Moon Veil going. We could do that. Something to look know. forward to, yeah. yeah. Elden Ring, oh Elden Ring. All right, so uh, that's actually very helpful. I'm, I'm, I'm quite pleased of this turn of events. Worth it. Where now? Uh, you said there's nothing worth it in the south. I mean, there's a there's a few things here and there. We could, yeah, there's there's items, there's things we could get. We could get a collectibles that'll add up over time. Oh, uh, smithing stones. Smithing stones. Yeah, let's upgrade if we can. Or, uh, actually, yeah, let's go visit the round. So, all right, let's go visit the round and to get our get our social in, yeah. Let's chat with people. Let's get the socials out. All right. Oh, I see you've uh, to the round this, this is Corin. I've, I've been here many times, but he was supposed to talk to us earlier. I didn't talk to him much because he, uh, gives incantations which require faith, which was what we're not focusing on at the moment. I mean, I guess I could buy his sorceries just to... If say that we got him. Of the round table His incantations, I mean. Lord, Hi, can I have your spells, please? How'd you get that wheel around your neck? Form, More importantly, men. how can you I not get it off? Do you still see it? Well, you know, the world keeps on grace. spinning. <laughs> and then he spins it like a hula hoop around the neck. Woo! Think of the splinters. So, well, I like that I can just go, hey, you! Come here! Ah! Just yank his so wheel over here and say, come here! Who ate my sandwich? And if you want to, you can fill in the holes and make it a roulette table. Woo! These are mostly incantations we can't use. They're right. Yeah, are there catch flames. Any that are worth it? Even if we could learn them, they won't do much because our faith is so piss poor. We don't we don't believe in nothing. What's the first one? Urgent heal. If we, we'd have to get a special like thing, like you know, this this is only for sorceries, like night maidens mist and blue spells. Incantations require something else entirely. Words. Those who live in death should be left well alone. I already killed one of them for you. Should you spy a mariner? I killed a mariner, though. So yeah. here, look. Oh, well, another fool who won't listen to reason. <laughs> eh? I like to kill things <laughs> that are bad. I'm good at it, it, okay? How Jeez. You the strength of beasts. Ooh, okay. You're inclined to haunt more of those who live in death and weed their death root. Those who live in now death just sounds like a TV show. You know those skeletons, the ones who are basically just bone. Those are the ones who live in death. Saying, saying, the hell with the Erd Tree, who needs it? We'll just live on our own and never really die. Very well. Show me your map. So then. Mark's on our little map here. Ooh. That was the hidden gateway that we went to at the very first step. All the way back there? You're, like, you remember. But I said, check it out. We need to go to this church, because there's a thing back there. And it sent us all the way over here. Yeah. Uh, here? Here, yeah. This is where he sent us. Holy shit. There's a guy in here, who because now we have death root, he will talk to us. So now we can see him, too. Side quest. I'd say so. Thank you, What's D. The map indicates where the gateway is hidden. It will lead you to Garank, the beast clergyman. Cool. I got you, brother. All right, who else? Well, uh, let's... We can talk to this lady in here. Walking into the round table, arms outstretched. Who wants to talk to me? Champion called by grace. I am Fia. Circumstances have compelled my First name, Soph. Great champion, would you allow me to hold you? But briefly, perhaps you uh, might share with me some of your life vigor. I've seen this clip. <laughs> when this game was first Doing releasing, so I saw this clip by tons of people. Of champion. And you, I am sure, will bear a Baldekin's blessing. Do a Baldekin's blessing, hmm? Where I come from, it is a sacred act. <laughs> Let me give you head pats tarnished. Well, okay. I mean, I mean, I got a pointy helmet, but uh, many people take off their clothes and uh, yeah, grow up, people. And let me in them titties. Hello. 
You see, Elden Ring knows its audience. It knows that we like punishing g uh, gameplay sometimes, but that we also want cuddles. <laughs> well, th this can't be. This can't be uh, saying things about uh, the fan base. She said you were warm. Most players who play Souls games are very, very cold. Because she is a. She lies in the deathbed. Oh. She lies with warriors on their last few moments and essentially takes their life essences. Good thing we're spry and full of life. Y y y yeah? Were you trying to suck my soul? We'll talk with her later. Okay. Here is where you can change your look. I mean, I kind of like our Albert Einstein going on right now. Well, like, like if you look at our face right now. That it, uh... Oh, there we go. Yes! Yeah, if, you, if, if you look at our face, it is. We have red eyes. Is that good or bad? Or I actually don't remember if we chose that by default. That's because of the side quest we did to get to the idiot chicken. Oh. Yes. Cool. I think we can we can change that. I forgot what the setting was, though, but it's just turning something off. Yeah, it's alright. It's fine, though. Alright, what do you got to say, Master Hugh? <laughs> Look at me. Those eyes tell a story. I just got head pats. Me nice. <laughs> now lay out your arms. <laughs> lay out your arms. Smack! Ow! 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 <laughs> we need a somber smithing stone five for Reduvia. Damn. But I think I would like to get Moonvale up if I can. Yes. To do. To do. Okay, do. so this works like. Other Souls games where they give you plus Pre one, plus two. Precisely. Do any of the weapons evolve, so to speak, become a brand new weapon? No. See, they kind of toned down a lot of the upgrading weapons after Dark Souls 1, because then you could really screw yourself and put like a plus 10 into a shield that didn't need that and screw yourself at a lot of, uh, uh, lot of stuff here. Okay. But yes, this place is open and now Gideon will talk to us. Uh, you. What is it? So now we can ask about all these things. Oh my god. Uh... Well, well uh, he, he's just basically telling us about all the demigods here, if you want to know. You know, Godric we just killed, Radon, he's crazy in the Caelid Wiles, Rykard, he's in, he's in Volcano Manor, Morgoth, he's up in the capital city, and Renala is at Raya Lucaria, and she's next. Let's talk about Nefeli's despair, she's kind of, uh, holed up in the hallway uh, there. You've already heard. Indeed. It seemed the whelp harbored suspicions. So I had no further use for her. Cast uh -huh. aside, what to do. A determined Because she just about found out about his secret. Quite frankly. I suspect not she was there the queen once. At the village. Uh -oh. Seeing all that he did. And yet she's right outside the door and he's saying these things. Alright, I've got this potion here that's supposed to make Nefeli into some kind of a uh I don't know. Mindless servant to some guy named Selvis. Ocean, what I think it is, bloody Selvis. I suppose he's up to something again. Oh, I would say it's weird that he knows him, but then again, he is Gideon of here, the all-knowing. You must. The round table has no code to speak of, but I ask you this: Are you really going to do the bidding of that twisted dolly botherer? No. Would you rather hand that potion to me? And see if we can't get one Ooh. <laughs> I like that idea better. Good. I'll dispose of the potion myself. You go and see Celavis, but don't give anything away. Just tell him that you tricked your mark into drinking the potion, as planned. Yes! Despite knowing next to bloody nothing, he's so far up his own arse, he won't <laughs> suspect a thing. His inevitable display of arrogance will... I mean, he is quite arrogant. He is the most... <laughs> he, he, I mean, you look at the three of uh, Lady Ron, uh, uh, Lady Ronnie's, uh, you know, cohorts. Three, trio, yeah. You've got the wolf man, you've got the giant man, and you've got the asshole. Asshole! <laughs> then you got Celibus. <laughs> oh, I love it. By the way, what an, what an interesting title to be blessed with all knowledge. That's just so interesting. It's like, hey, do you know what this is? Yes. <laughs> well, how about this? Yes. Oh, no, that too. Uh, what, oh, that uh, one's an easy one. Uh, what about this? Oh, yes. You mean you don't know about that one? 
and then you make something up real quick. Do you know about this? Well, yeah. No, because it's not real. <laughs> or like, yeah, I know about it. You made it up. <laughs> Shit. He does know all. Here's here's Ensha. Uh, Edge Lord. Coming from a guy who dressed up like that in his message. <laughs> oh yeah, what an edge lord. All right. Uh, uh, is there anybody else worth it, or are we just kind of big I mean, chilling right now? This is, of course, a thing you always come back to. But I guess there's one other neat thing that we can do in the meantime to see how we're doing. And that involves this middle part here. <laughs> You're smashing all the chairs. <laughs> My chairs, no. No. Oh, hey, it's Selvas. Or not? Yeah, yeah. Wait, that's Selvas? No, no, wait, that's. Uh. I forgot his name. Again, Shit. After all. I apologize for any offense given by my bearing, but I'm quite unable to move. You see. So. He's the mage that we found in uh, Castle Stormfront. He can teach us a few skills, mainly just Ash of Wars, and but... And we can tell him we beat Godric. I defeated Godric. Ah, you defeated Godric and claimed yourself This is D, I think. Mm. Looks like we both got what we wanted out of Stormvale, didn't we? You well okay, done, dude? Friend. Something to mark the occasion. Go on. Take it. <gasps> A plus eight rapier! Wow, we can't wield that! Oh, Should nice. Or can we? I still can't move. My fighting days are behind me. No need to be polite. I've no use for it anymore. What's what's growing out of your, of your legs there? It looks like, uh... What are those things? Looks like tendrils and ick! It's Rogier! I forgot his name. Rogier. Rogier. Oh, so you've met D. D is an old friend. We found ourselves journeying. Not as good as C. Definitely not my best friend, which is A. Yeah, I totally read that wrong. I thought his name was D. Never again to cross. My bad. Yeah, that's hardly an uncommon fate for two friends. Well, he just got bad friends, I guess. Hmm. So can we indeed wield this? I got a feeling no. But I would love to be surprised. Where is it? Here it is. Holy shit, we can! We can indeed. How heavy is it? Well, can we carry it on our own? I saw a pretty big weight. It's yeah. just three and a half. Oh, it's not as... I thought this said 35. That's that's my bad. Can I even, like, shed a little bit of these? Maybe get a little one of things up here. Fuck it's there it is. Yeah, there we go. All right, let's take a look. We can't do anything with it in here because we're in a safe spot. I know where we can. It try actually it. looks pretty light. See, I thought it was going to be something like big, two-handed, but no, it's just a nice-looking sword. How many people died down here? <laughs> Jesus. Mad Tongue Alberic. Oh. Hi. He shows up. Gives us a gentleman's bow. Cool. And then the pain begins. Yeah. You're not kidding. Oh shit, frostbitten. Uh oh, uh oh. Cold, 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 cold. He also has Estus too. Oh, that's not fun. Flint Blade Phalanx? What's that? Oh, that. Okay. Jesus! Let's go back to doing what we were doing there. Yeah. That actually worked fantastic. Okay, that didn't. Oh! That's nice. That is very nice. Can you swing around him and do it again? Ha ha! Ha ha! Ah! Oh my god, you almost had him. Okay, run up there. No! Oh, too bad for you, man. Wait, did he run out? Yeah, he ran out. Oh my god. That's a thing that can happen? Oh! <laughs> well, yeah. Stab him while he's you down. Can, you can run out too. Can't do that. Damn. Gotta be a gentleman about this, you know. So we get the Tontus tongue. That was awesome. While we're down here, we can explore a few things. Huh. Well, nice. Pretty, pretty good. I see. Ooh, we're going here. Not bad. It's the entire downstairs. Oh, ho, ho. 
And a bedroom. Ooh, what's in here? Uh, oh. Ew. A cipher pata. Pillage remains. Good lord. Is that a weapon? Yeah, it is a weapon. We can't use it because our faith is too crap. But if we're you, if we, if you're using faith, it is a uh, unarmed weapon, kind of, and it weighs nothing. Hmm. Like you're basically just punching. Mm. But if your faith is high, it'll do a pretty some good stuff, including like an unblockable blade where it's like you know, whoa, big, 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 big sword type deal. So I love that certain weapons we can't wield because we don't believe, and also some weapons because we're too stupid. <laughs> Well, we, we, no, we got to be like you know a, a, a PhD level worth okay, to use okay, this. Okay. We're, I'd Ed, say we're educated. I'd say we're about uh, mostly in our undergraduate at the moment. I'd say we're oh. more street smarts than anything else. Yeah, 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 we're know. educated, but only in certain well, areas. What do you need? He seems to be getting worse. Uh, I don't know. There's a lot of flies buzzing around him now. Almost as if he's infected with the root of death or something. Yeah, necrosis kicking in. Yeah. Losing his legs and yeah. soon to be the rest of him. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, well, I see. How you don't have any eyes. She sees her fingers. <laughs> uh, <laughs> put, puts her hands on your face. Ah, uh, yes, I see. She's like, ah, you got a pe you, you beat Godric, did you? Wonderful. And into remembrances. They are Can we speed this up? And I will lend you the strength of the fingers. So with the big gigantic remembrance we get for beating one of the demigods. We can get stuff from that. With the power of remembrances, you can draw the power of remembrances namesake. So, looking here, we can either get the Axe of Godric or the Grafted Dragon. Oh my god, both of those sound awesome. They do? But I'm gonna go with the Axe of Godric. Uh, not, that, not that they matter, because they both kind of stink. Because uh, oh. it's because it's fucking Godric. Fucking loser. Can I see the dragon stats really quick? We need faith. It can breathe fire, 100% critical, and 89 physical. Grant the small dragon a fleeting glimpse of life and thrust it skyward, spewing flames over a wide frontward area. There's better dragon spells we can learn, so I'm just gonna get this one. That's pure power, I just saw. Nice. Alright. I think we're about done here. Worth it. I think I think we've about done that all we can do here that at the is moment. Lovely. So, yes. So now, uh, where should we go next? Uh a lot we can do here. You want to take on a demigod? I think we'll do that. Start going through, uh, where, where's that? Right, Lucaria. Right, Lucaria, thank you. Right. Well, Actually, let's... But first, I think I want to go here. Okay. Just to, before we say farewell, I want to show off uh, one of these things. While we were in the town of Celia last week, we picked up an imbued stone sword uh, key. How many do we have now? We, we still have one. So. We got two of these Belfries left. I will have you choose which one we jump into. Because the one that we needed, Underline needed to get into, was just this precipice of anticipation. Should we, so we could get the idiot chicken. <laughs> so. Your choices are now. Uh, this place over here. Uh, what we get? The Crumbling Lands. And where the fuck's that last one? Oh, where's that last one now? Come on. They didn't just vanish on me now. I think it did. He's being mean. They... they just vanish? I, I just can't find it. Oh. I'm being a dummy and I just can't see it's it. It's not up the hill, is it? Maybe it is. Yeah, because there's the fourth one. We just went there. Okay, here it is. It was beside that first one. Crumbling lands and the night sky unceasing. Oh, that just sounds awesome. Night sky well, unceasing? What are the advantages? No advantages, they're just coming attractions of things to come. Alright, uh, yeah, night sky. Night sky unceasing. In we go! Whoa! Whoa! 
And then I got sucked through the TV in my in Elder. Oh my God! Okay, I remember this place. We've already been we've already been here, not Crown Eternal City, but we haven't been up here. This is a place that is just way too high for us to use. And I don't even think there's anything of worth here. Damn it! So we can drop, do some uh, clever dropping down yeah, yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Like that one down there. Uh, yeah. That yeah. Oh yeah. Here we go. Yeah, down there, there, and then down Boop. there. Good enough. Yeah, because we were on the other side. We couldn't make it over here yet. There it is. But I will. Will I live through that? Guess we'll see. Oh, okay. No problems. Okay. Cool. I didn't want to be the one that led you to your death. I mean, you haven't died yet in this entire series. Nope. <laughs> nope. Not yet, no. Nope. Ah. Oh my god! Still now. A modeled necklace. Hmm. Just raises a couple. This is some stats. No, oh, okay. What do I am after? Is this feller? Hi. You gonna try to sneak up on him? Oh no, there is no sneaking up on you. How do you feel about blood? Oh, you like it a lot. Ah! I would have hurt a lot if you hit me with that. I'm a fan of. <laughs> I'm a fan of diamond dust. I'm a fan of bleeding. I want to see you bleed. Ow, Ow, that hurts a Jesus. lot, man. Stop. I think that's why he put him all the way over there. Okay, that's... Oh, 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 my God, man. Okay, well. Yeah. Alright, don't let him back you off the cliff. Ah, jeez. Alright. Great. <laughs> Can't block this though. Yeah, just kind of, kind of lead him back into it if you can. Oh. Oh. <laughs> no! <laughs> you know, I didn't think this was gonna get any better for us. We can we can come take him on any time. Not like anything important. To, oh, <laughs> seven thousand souls! Oh no! I mean, it's still seven thousand bucks. I feel bad for leading you to your doom. So I'm gonna go get a few more so we can get our intelligence up so we can use the the weapon I actually want to use, Moon Veil. Okay. So next time on Elden Ring, we'll probably head into I don't know Raya Lucari or something. Know, we you gotta, just got a hundred souls from nothing. <laughs> what died? This episode.